out of that strange hole in the sky. Clever girl. Mother says I meddle. Perhaps. I know everything. Ask me. Hmm. Yeah, uh, welcome back to Blind Let's Play of The Witcher and we are on to the chapter 4. And, uh, let's see if we can find out what the heck is going on in here. I don't know where I am and apart from the fact that Triss just saved me when Princess, Princess Ada almost caught me with her soldiers. Princess Ada was uh, secretly allied with the Salamandra as I suspected along the way. And um, yeah, well, the most important thing is that I am alive, I am safe, now let's find out where I am and what to do next. I assume I can't go back to Visima as Geralt is probably outlaw now in there because of Princess Ada and all the city guards. I saw a city. The submerged city of an ancient race full of treasure and monsters. Now fish people live there. I fear them, but the one sitting by the statue of the lady seems jolly. I'm losing track. And I sometimes take fish to the sick and poor elves when the fisher king catches them. And on the island you can meet the lady. More beautiful than Alina. She yearns too. I'm completely lost. Stupid adults. How can you take care of us when you don't understand and you're always yearning? What is this place? This is the shore. Beyond lies murky waters and beyond that fields. By boat you can get to the island. You do know a lot. I know everything. Ask me. What's happened here recently? Alina, the village chief's daughter, will soon marry. For gold, Mother says. Right. Mother also says Alina's sister, Selina, yearns for Julian. He's Alina's fiancé who lives at the inn. What does yearn mean? She really likes Julian. Oh, then Julian yearns for Alina, Selina yearns for Julian, and Alina likes Julian's gold but yearns for Adam. Adults are stupid. Undeniably. I know everything. Ask me. I, I, I see you really know everything. Do you know who I am? You have white hair, like every grandpa. You're ugly, but I like you. That's lucky. <laughs> I know everything. Ask me. <laughs> Best discussion ever in this game. Is the shore safe? Yes. Sometimes those evil fish people creep out of the water and drive off the funny fishermen. I hide under the fisherman's hut. Clever. Of course. Take care. <laughs> Where's my cat? Yeah, okay, so there's some some love triangle going on in this city. There is some uh, mysterious lady somewhere here who is more beautiful than one of the ladies involved in that love triangle. So yeah, we should have a wonderful chapter 4 here. And uh, hopefully we'll also learn how to how to get back to the matters at hand and uh, well at least hunt down Asar Javed if nothing else. After after recording that intro sequence just there, uh, my microphone broke down and it's actually been two weeks since I recorded that discussion with the child. And uh, start of start of this chapter, so I am now now back and back into game and trying to remember what was going on and. Uh, Hopefully, hopefully the audio audio levels are okay for you. As uh, I'll try to try to look into things again. So uh, a lot of the lot of the quests in the in the chapter three are now gone. So all 
Okay, they can still continue with the fist fights and dice games. Mm. Yeah, there was a lot of lot of things revealed at the end of chapter three, including the involvement of Princess Ada in all the things. Yeah, okay, so I need to need to wait until Ada comes down. Catch my second wind. Interesting that quest is still open. Open for the dentist. But I am now here in totally new area. The lakeside. And the only only thing I know about it is Fisher King's hut and statue of the Lady of the Lake, and everything everything I learned from the young kid. But uh, I guess I will go and check the statue first, that it is close by. There was also a sort of a vision. What? What? What can I priest? Okay. There was also some vision of an of a city. So I guess it's kind of hidden or some magical magical city and maybe this maybe this lady lady of the lake has something to do with it. There's an altar, so there's probably some sacrifice I can do. Do for the lady. Mm. But uh, maybe talking to this this creature. Okay, so this Vodian noise, some sort of a race. Do I know know about them already? They listed in monsters. Yes, they are. I, I remembered reading a book about this Vodia noise. The Vodianoi are an ancient sentient race. They worship their own gods and their priests deal with divine matters. Land dwellers know little of these underwater creatures and the cults which flourish among them and what is known inspires fear. Deities of the deep lend their powers to Vodianoi priests, enable them to cast curses and spells. Okay, so these these Vodianois or Vodianois are uh, Kind of a maybe under underwater or water water race. So maybe maybe all this will eventually take me to that lake or something. And I'm Geralt. Pleased to meet you. I don't speak your language. Now you your language I speak very well. Evidently. Let's talk. Kneel before lady. Speak easy. No kneel. Must be Daganananpatai. No speak. So I'm to pay tribute to the Lady of the Lake? Exact. Well, uh, I, see, I see no reason not to kneel. I don't, I don't see a need for Geralt to be arrogant in this. Start big fights with, with new race. New race for us. All right.
Talk. Gul pull talo. What's Witcher in your language? Which Malal Bull? Which Malal? Which Malal Bull? Bull must be. No bull mean idiot. <laughs> All right, then I'm Witch Malal Bull. <laughs> yes, so you be. <laughs> Which Malal Bull? Which Malal Bull? I need to. Need Try and remember that. Got any work for someone skilled with a sword? Ghoul, bull. Humans great enemies to Vodianoi. Hire Witcher Big for Vodianoi to kill. Witcher Big at Crypt. We love we humans. Yet humans swim our waters. Did I hear you right? Another Witcher? Gralol, exact. Disloving ghouls at Crypt. I need to speak to him. Farewell. There was one dialogue option. Talk! Gul pull talu! Which pull. which. which molol pool. Everything alright? Great sadness. No peace in house. I'm sorry to hear that. Talk! Gul pull talu! Farewell. Okay. I wonder, I wonder if that is, that is Berengar or not. Or maybe, maybe this is the time in the game when Geralt gets reunited with her. Uh, oh man, I, I don't even remember the names of them. Names of the witchers from the very beginning. Like Eskel, who taught Geralt the fist fighting. Or, uh... Oh, Leo died. Oh, and Vesemir was the old... old one. That's it, so Vesemir. Vesemir and Eskel. Hmm. Unless there's a new Witcher who we get introduced into now. Nayad, that looks like a Dryad. Hello, lady. Welcome, warrior. Greetings. If not for my woes, I'd rejoice in a swim with you. What concerns you? Let's talk. Who are you? A naiad. A water nymph. I serve the Lady of the Lake. I wonder why, why Geralt's tone was so, uh, so uh, kind of a, uh, I don't know, demanding. Like, who are you? Why, uh, why ask like that? Why not in a friendly manner? Well, you mentioned woes. Terrible indeed. I lost my turquoise necklace as I swam in moonlight, a gift from the Lady of the Lake. Where did you swim? I usually bathe in the lake, yet that night I dared the river near the village. Sadly, the drowners abide there, led by Zephyr. Who's Zephyr? Once one of Vizima's most famous thieves. He moved as quietly as the wind, and quite handsome. And now? He once escaped to the sewers, but his loot proved too heavy. He joined the drowned dead, but old habits rarely die as easily. He still steals? Of course. Doubtless he stole my necklace. The drowners ever protect him. Hmm. I'll search for your necklace. How wonderful! 
I have no gold with which to pay. But perhaps some trinkets could prove useful. It's a deal, then. I should await you at the end of the beach, in an enchanting lagoon. How do I find Zephyr? If you slay enough drowners, he'll appear to discover the problem. Remember, drowners only venture out at night. Where do I find the drowners protecting Zephyr? They gather at night here on the shore. If you borrow a boat, you may reach the island where you'll find others. Some linger near the village. Farewell. Yeah, indeed. <laughs> Old habits die hard, killing drowners. I'm not sure if there's a... I'm not sure if there are stat... What? Circle of waning magic. I'm not sure if there are stats in there. I think there are not, but I think I've killed at least 200 drowners or so. This is a new, new kind of herb, I think. Oh, there's a fireplace. Okay, what do we? Not yet. Odd, odd sounds. Somewhere. Okay, that's there. That's the girl I talked to, I think. Was it? Yes. Okay, so if I need to, I can come back to her. I guess there are no drowners here, as the little girl is all safe in here. I dare to enter the place, but... Ah, the door is on this side. Very well. Ah, right. Fisher King. Fisher King, it is at sleep. So, uh, let's... Let's get some stuff. Before we wake him up, old oh, chest. Visiman champion. Okay, so I need to remember these two in, in case I need to drink with the guy. There often is often is a hint here in case someone wants to drink. And for some reason, I. I think that the guy called Fisher King would like some booze. Yeah, he has that. That uh, bottle on his neck. Hmm? Or, Greetings. Or sack. You're the Fisher King, right? Mm hmm. Hmm. Well, I have a professional interest in the area. You see, I'm a witcher. Any monsters in the lake? Hmm... Emphis Benas? Dragonflies? Water Creepers? No? Hmm... I see. The lake's safe. While we're talking... Hmm... <laughs> well, I'm not gonna use the... Well, let's ask about it anyway. Could I use your boat? Mm hmm Take care. Okay, so now I have permission. That guy was... That guy was fun to talk to. Okay, so there are herbs this way, so that means also that we can go this way. Ah, there are drowners. Okay, just making 
sure I have this right silver sword fast style let's kill some of these guys and uh, see see if we can get that thief to appear I, I could turn on the cave entrance. So let's let's talk to the elf. Nice effect. I want to loot this so I don't don't have those things in the view. This cave here. Any news about the Sky at all? Go, Dwan. Hmm. Uh, so I can enter the place? Is that it? I thought I have some leveling. Leveling done. Vitality bleeding. Still no gold levels, so those will come at level 30. Okay, knockdown resistance. And really no interesting options there anymore. So dodge option. Pain resistance. Well, I guess that could be useful. Sign duration. Something else with the silver one. I've done these. Maybe I'll leave. Okay, that sounds. That sounds nice. Ah, wait a minute, no. That's one. Strong silver. Okay, that's I don't have anymore. Okay, so strong steel is strong now. Where will I... Where will I put all these? All these points later. Don't know. Is there some special special recipe that I got that would give me some some ability?
better alchemical base. Yeah, I think this was it. Mutation stamina upgrade. Did I miss my chance to create this ver werewolf's wrath? Predator dexterity. Oh, I should pay more attention to these things. Well, let's rest for rest for one hour. I need to go to the other side. Crypt. So do I go there now? Or do I look into this cave? Dog on a human leash. What are you, what's your problem? I've been helping your kind. I don't have any reason reason to go to the cave just yet, so I'm not gonna. Instead, I'll take the boat, boat, and go clear the drowners on the island. And I guess there's then uh, there'll be other other stuff happening at the island as well. I guess. to save There are there are drowners there. Let's see what the journal says about the island. A picturesque island that rises unexpectedly out of the lake. This is where the chosen few can meet the lady of the lake. The small strip of land overgrown with trees is also a haven for hundreds of animals. The degenerate Vodenoi have built an altar there from stones extracted from the deep. Use the shrine to offer bloody sacrifices to Dakon. it whoa 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 lady of the lake
doesn't look like a water dryad, but similar. Welcome, Forgive me. I don't remember your name. For you do not know it, but I know you. By reputation. I should warn you Dandelion takes many liberties in his ballads. I have confidence in my source. The mermaid, Sheenaz. Mermaid? Yes. Why are you surprised? What did Sheenaz tell you? That you prevented conflict between the Prince of Aglival and the inhabitants of the underwater city of Iz. Thanks to you and your friends, humans and the Vaudianoi of Iz tolerate one another. Encouraging. I hope all goes well here. Shinaz mentioned your intelligence. I invite you to use it. Speak with the Vaudianoi chaplain and the human named Julian. Who are you? They call me the Lady of the Lake. Is that a talkative fisherman your servant? Servant, no. Women on occasion need men. To secure food and protection, naturally. I see. Hosts of knights once defended my honor, but that was long ago. My poor sickly fisher king alone remains. Milady, they say I returned to life, but lost my memory. Can you help me? I know you didn't return by chance. First, you must answer. Do you believe in destiny? I don't think um, at least I've I've not I've not played played Geralt as a kind of a master of his own fate. He has this mission mission and kind of an Witcher Witcher code that he follows. And uh, with this this journey, journey he's had, uh, it's been, uh, it has taken him towards something. So in a way, destiny. I'm thinking about this because I'm, I'm just I'm wondering if this has if this is just a simple question or if this has some some effects on the future. I'm not gonna pick number two, so it's gonna be number three or one. Yeah, maybe maybe something more. It's it's not just it's not just destiny. I believe in something more. Mysterious and confident. You will regain your identity and achieve your aim. Yet you evade my questions. Perhaps there's something more you speak of requires other than a simple choice between destiny and free will. My beliefs defy easy classification. Let's discuss something else. Yes? Milady, what happened to those hosts in shining armor? I fought the legend of the Holy Grail. My bold knights, I know not why, determined to embark on a mission. They claimed it their destiny to find the Holy Grail. Alas, 
My powers cannot vanquish destiny. I failed at guiding the poor wretches onto the right path. The Grail was never found? Just so. Know you the legend of the Grail? I lost my memory. Speak with a hermit watching over the graves of those brave seekers. Though boring, he knows the Grail's legend perfectly. I'll visit him. If you return intent on a mission of paramount importance, believe me, I can be unpleasant. Well, I wouldn't, wouldn't want that, my lady. Farewell. Oh, Royal Weaver. Sensitive to silver. Conveniently, there's a fireplace where I can do some alchemy before I attack them. I don't have many potion bases, though. Wyvern only a hundred meters that way wasn't too bothered with me making some potions here. Okay, so now we have that. Let's see what this wyvern is made of. Hopefully, this isn't some. Don't attack the wyvern. Don't attack the wyvern or the lady of the lake will be angry. Kind of deal. Yeah, with this... Um, Wyvern doesn't even get an attack in. What do we get from it? It's all kinds of things. Wyvern, fireplace. I wonder if there's a mission for these Wyverns. Oh, 
fighting so many of them at once. Temple. Ah, right on. So this must be Temple, this shrine. some wyvern meat. The sacrifice will do anything, but what is this? What is this? This taken? Oh, I have it here. A mythical creature, according to the legend, it rests at the bottom of the lake near a village of murky waters. A deity. I can summon summon a deity. But what would I do then? Come on, okay, this corpse there. Come on. Come here. They will all come. On the other hand, here's a good place to fight them. If they do all come. Some kind of portal looking or some sort of altar there underwater. Alright, that uh, that altar goes down there below the below the surface, which makes sense. If the if the deity is at the bottom of the lake.
makes it some sort of a special axe. I still hate the inventory system with the, all those... Uh, all those... Uh, All those limitations that I can only carry those weapons instead of putting the putting the weapons in the inventory. What it is, the wyverns will respawn when I return. So, basilisk. Okay. Guess I'll go see about those as well. Yeah, it's been. I haven't fought one of these. It's it's good that I good that I bought all those. Okay, so definitely not strong style. That's other other one is blocked behind the other, so it can't attack. Difficulty, difficulty if there is any in these uh, in these uh, fights comes from uh, when Geralt needs to find more than one, more than one foe. Uh, I I thought thought about um, putting in the mod and increase the combat difficulty, but then again, that's that's not what I'm that's not what I'm looking for from this this let's play. It's not the it's not the combat. It's not the kind of a hardcore challenge. I 
I'm, in I'm enjoying the story and... Story and where... Uh, where this all will take Geralt. And I'm also very interested in... in to seeing what... Uh, what all the choices I've made along the way, what... What will... What will happen and what effect they will have in, in, the, in the game and in the world. So, um, yeah. Kind of the combat. Combat is a necessary evil. Necessary evil in all that. So that would... The Drowners on the river bank. Aha, uh -huh, okay. So there's the crypt, there's a witcher there. Identity unknown, and then there's the murky waters. Which is the village. So I guess I will then head. Maybe I'll first... First, see about this crypt. And uh, I know, I know, I've been, I've been criticizing the game a lot, and uh, kind of uh, getting, getting annoyed at times. But uh, I really like to like the game, but uh, it's a uh, when. When my favorite games are games like Oblivion and Fallout 3. And uh, I'll see how Skyrim turns out, but uh, those games where I can do anything I want, I can follow the... Mm, it's probably a dangerous place as there's corpse here. Yeah, when, uh, when my favorite games are like that, where I can, I can choose where to go, it's... Uh, I can follow the main story, or I can, I can go do everything, anything I want. Then uh, in The Witcher, I have these environments which are, it's a kind of free roaming, but then again, they are nothing like that. It's, they are quite, quite strict. But on the other hand, it's a, it's a different kind of game. So uh, don't, don't get me wrong. But uh, it's just. Uh, that's that's part of the part of the reason why I I haven't been haven't been like uh, really excited about the game. I I've enjoyed the story all the time, but there's uh, these uh, faces faces in between are something that I that haven't been haven't been so satisfying as they might have been in some other games. But. Uh, so I will, I will get through this. I will continue, and uh, actually, I will continue from here on the next video. So uh, why don't you join me then, and we'll we'll see who's hiding in the crypt, and uh, we'll also deal with the rest of the rest of the drowners, and hopefully find that Zephyr Jeff guy. And I guess then our way will take us to the town, murky waters. And then there's also the hermit we need to talk to. Did I get a message for that? I actually didn't. Well, anyway, uh, thanks for watching this episode of Blind Let's Play Twitcher. And uh, I'll see you on the next one. Take care and bye bye.